Hey guys, for those of you who are new here, my name is Rachel Change and I'm a beauty photographer and retoucher based in the UK. Today's video is going to be very quick and very exciting. Uh, I know many of you or most of you are on lockdown or in self-isolation due to this crazy madness that's going on in the world and that's perfect time to brush up or level up your retouching skills and when you work so long on a picture and reach the level and the result that you really want then you're looking for a way how to show it to the world and you know proudly present all your hard work so today video is going to help you with that because i will show you cool and exciting way how you can create uh, before and after gifs or gifs if you want uh, in photoshop so before we jump into the video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell as well so you don't miss any future uploads also like this video and leave me a comment if you feel like it and stay till the end because i have some exciting announcement and some uh, giveaway i can say it's not really a giveaway but Wait and see. I crossed 2,000 subscribers, which is fantastic, and I thank you very much. For this occasion, I want to do something for you as well. So, stay till the end, and without further ado, let's jump into Photoshop and create some GIFs or GIFs. Welcome to Photoshop. I have this picture here I took a couple of months ago uh, as a part of one super exciting project. Uh, I will leave the link to it in the description box below so you can go have a look at the full project if you want to. But we want to create a gift out of this before and after gift. So let's have a look at the before picture. Hold Alt and click this eye icon next to background layer. So this is our before and this is our after and we want to make a gif or gif out of it i don't know how to pronounce it everybody pronounces it differently so i'll just stick with the, both of them probably <laughs> uh, so we want to get the gif <laughs> so we can show it on social media and it's a like super creative way how to show off your before and after and show off the, all the hard work you've done to the image so first we need to do is resize the image because gifs or gifs can only be in certain size if you want to post them on social media so let's hit image image size and resize it down on a height or on the one of those bigger numbers uh, type 1100 and then hit ok now the picture is downsized uh, so it's let's check it's in the 1100 times 880 hit ok and now we need to create uh, two versions of this image so we need to create the after and the before how we do that to create a new layer right here and hit alt shift ctrl e that will create a stamp visible layer and all the adjustments of what we applied before now will be merged into one uh, layer uh, now we want to create the before layer and how we do that is just simply turning uh, off everything so hold alt next to the background uh, layer and click on this eye icon that will show you our before and let's go back up create a new layer and again hit uh, alt Control shift e it's creating stamp visible layers so only the layers that is visible will get created so this is our after and right here underneath this is our before now we need to merge these two into a gif i will do that on a separate image so hit file new and I create 1100 times 880 picture orientation portrait because this picture is portrait as well and hit create now we have a new project open let's go back to the original one hold control and select both these layers that we created and just drag them up here to the next new project now we have them both here let's just adjust it a little bit so it's nicely covering the whole background and now we can start creating the GIF. Go up to window and hit timeline and it will show you this little window. Do you have a two options here? Create a video timeline or frame animation. We all want to create a frame animation. So hit click on that and now this is our timeline here. See first picture is the unedited one is the one uh, that is on the top of everything. I'll just make it on one second and down here select forever 
Now click this new layer icon and turn off this before layer. So only visible layer will be this after one. Uh, it should transfer all the settings from the previous one. So again, uh, one second and forever. And now if you hit play, it's gonna automatically play forever before and after. Now we wanna save it. Let's go to file, export and save for web. And this window is gonna pop up and we can choose here, instead of JPEG, we'll choose GIF or GIF. Uh, we don't need to change anything in here. This is our size. This is uh, the final size, 1.3 megabytes. That's fine. Uh, you can click play here if you want to make sure it's working. Great, and now we hit save. Find the folder that you want to save it into. We can just rename it to before and after one because you can create however many you want and hit uh, save. And there we have it. If we then go to have a look, now it's here before and after GIF. There we have it all working and if you upload this file to Facebook, Instagram or any other um, social media platforms, it will be showing automatically on a loop forever. Here is uh, one more quick tip. If you want to add a text into it, for example, if you want to sign it uh, that this is my work and I done this, just type your name or whatever you want to add, uh, place it somewhere, let's say here the layer needs to be on top of everything so if you go back to window and timeline uh, now you see it's automatically added in there if it stays on top of it so feel free to add your watermark or just sign your work so nobody can steal it from you because internet is uh, not a friendly place at times so that's it guys, there you have it, a uh, super easy way how to create GIFs or GIFs uh, in Photoshop. And now to the exciting part. Uh, as I mentioned at the beginning of this video, I crossed 2000 subscribers, which again I am very thankful for. And for this occasion I want to give you back something. Uh, so I decided to retouch one picture from you guys, from my subscribers, uh, that you will send me and I will make a video out of it. So if you want to participate and if you want to have a chance to get your picture retouched by me, uh, send it to this email address. Photo so at verachange.com please send me only low resolution jpegs for a preview and i will pick one of you and if i do i'll send you an email back to request a full resolution raw picture um, there are a couple of rules you need to be a copyright owner of the image uh, for you to participate in this challenge or in this video uh, and also you need to be happy with me creating a retouching video out of it. A uh, retouching video should go out on Sunday so you have time till this Saturday I would say next three days to send me your pictures if you want to participate. Again email address is photo at .com. Please don't forget to add subject uh, retouching video so I know uh, it's related to this one. I'm super excited about this and if you want to participate uh, don't forget to you know hit me with your pictures and i will see you here on sunday with the video thank you very much for watching bye